What's up, everybody? Jason from jazbeescasebreaks.com. We just sold out 2020 Panini Impeccable Football three box case break. Picker Teens number one on jazbeescasebreaks.com. And again, this is a new release, guys. Always a fan favorite three box case. Uh, look for these metal cards and potentially golds and the big RPAs of all these big rookies in this 2020 draft class. So, here are the customer names I bought in straight up. We only had three teams not sell, so we had a random number block style of them. So good luck. And of course, here are the customers that are part of the RMB that has the Bengals, Bucks, and Eagles. Alrighty, guys. Good luck. Some Chiefs? Oh, yeah, man. Let's do it, Juan. What's going on, man? Boxes are like brown this year. Morning. That's how we're doing. What's up, man? How's it going? All right, guys. So here you go. Impeccable football. We have these for personals on jazbees.com. And we have all the new releases on there, guys. Let's get it rolling. Panini one on one basketball should be fun. Got nowhere to go, but been in for these cases and I won't pack it so far. Oof. All right, man, let's do it. And every case is a little different, of course, but. So far, not so good, but let's, let's change that, man. All right, so no metal card in this one. And we can definitely use those blanks, man. We're running out of those. Shockingly, we are. I know, man. I got to pull you something enough where you can just come pick it up, right? All right. First one, guys, is for the Baltimore Ravens. 28 out of 50, Mark Ingram. Nice little base card right there. Should be like 130s, all of them, right? We got George Kittle to 50. Really? No way. Wow. So that was a great box set. <laughs> I told you that stuff was going to be... That, that might actually sell pretty high because... It's a subset that he only has like 19 of those, right? Tip it to 12, 75. That is great, man. Well, I don't feel that. I mean, honestly, that's that's way higher than I thought it would go. I thought maybe closer to a thousand, maybe, just because of the subset. All right, looks like we have a blockchain. Jerry Judy, Elegance, Rookie, Helmet, and Patch Autos. So again, these are digital only, guys. Remember, the blockchains that you auction with um, auction with are uh, digital and you can get them in person, but these, these ones in the products are actually just digital only, and I think they're starting to let you know that. Um, if you only see number four there, DJ, that means we did number three yesterday, probably. I'm assuming. Um, I wasn't breaking yesterday, so I don't know if we had three and four up, or we finished three and then went to four. Um, but yeah, if, if number three's not there anymore and you bought into that, then most likely we already finished that. Uh, if the filler that's on the website right now is for number four. Unless that's just a typo, man. That might just be a typo, then. Mm, 
It doesn't say we're giving away spots at number three. So maybe it's just a little confusion. Where does it say that? Lost. Do a break of clarity donors one box. At the end of the break, we randomize all thirty customer names. Top eight win a spot in the seventy eighty dollar noir basketball. I know it says two box random team, but I don't see the three unless I'm looking at something else, DJ. But yeah, I mean, I, like I said, if we already got done with number three, um, oh, oh, you're getting me confused. You're getting me confused. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Um. So filler number three, meaning that that's our third clearly Donner's hobby box break. Sorry, but we're giving away eight spots in random teams number four of Noir. So number three just means that that's our third box break of that specific filler. Has nothing to do with the Noir basketball break. That's just the third one we've done. If you get me, I was getting confused a little bit right there. Clem Portis, wow, 14 out of 25. So yeah, we usually get like, so like we usually can go up to like 400, number 400, number 500, depending on how many fillers we actually do. And we reuse this, we reuse the same style boxes for a lot of our fillers. But yeah, no, sorry, I was a little confused right there, but yeah, so that's just our third break of that, but that doesn't mean that it's specifically tied into random teams number three. It's just that third box of it that we've done as a filler. All right, Washington football team going to Mark. Whoa, sorry about that, guys. 75 out of 10, or 10 out of 75. We got Noah. That card got stuck together to this one. Uh, that is uh, Dolphins going to Gary. That's all right, guys. Just Quinn Cephas to 75. Sorry about that, Quinn. Uh, Detroit Lions are going to Derek. I was stuck together. Wow, look at that. Dante Culpepper. How about that? Dante Culpepper. 71 out of 75. Minnesota Vikings. Going to Jarrett. Randy Moss, 8 out of 15. Another one for the Vikings. And last one here is Anthony McFarland Jr. Looks like it's a little chippy here on the top right. Thicker cardstock. A nice helmet and patch auto, 24 out of 35. Steelers. Going to mark. All righty. I know that was that, that was like that. I was like Culpepper to Moss for sure. They did that. They did that on purpose. That'd actually be kind of cool if they did, like, a coalition of that. Like, all the people would be upset, but, like, if they linked up, like, players that played with each other. So, like, Randy to Culpepper and, you know, I don't know. You could do, like, another player that linked up with their wide receiver. All right, here's a metal card. We'll save this for last.
Joe Mixon. That is out of 50. 26 out of 50. Don't worry, guys. These are good blue tape as well. Ed Reed, 75. Actually, if these had 120s. Cool. Tyron Matthews, autograph out of 35 impressions. Chiefs, Juan. Come on, man. You're going to come for a honey badger? Also, guys, for the local customers, I'm going to let you guys know. I don't think Joe's announced it too much, but we're going to have some really, really nice uh, Black Friday sales here in store as well. So, if you guys are in the local area for LA, definitely come down. Quinn Cephas again to 99. So, gives you an excuse to come see our beautiful shop. I personally won't be here. I'll be out of town, but I will be here in spirit. But I'll be here for Cyber Monday, though. Howie Long. Six out of ten for the Raiders. David with that one. That is a beautiful looking card. Howie. There you go, Oliver. We got a number block spot. Number block spot, Jalen Hurts, autograph, 46 out of 49. I don't know, man. Is Doug feeling the pressure? I was looking at the press conference today. <laughs> Dude looks so indecisive, man. He looks so lost. Is one starting on Wednesday? I mean, uh, today it's for Wednesday. Yes. Is it going to change tomorrow? I don't know. <laughs> All righty. 46 out of 49. Six going to Spiro. He's probably feeling the pressure of so much Philadelphia media right now. He's not used to this. He's like, I want a Super Bowl, man. Give me a break. But that was already in the past, bro. Gotta win more. Elegance, rookie, helmet, and patch autos. Card number 142. Tyler Johnson for the Bucks, another random number block team. That's going to wane with spot zero because it is a redemption. So TB and spot zero. There you go. Adam, what's going on, Bill? How's it going? Morning, morning. All right, we'll skip the metal card, guys. And we'll save that for last. And we'll do one more box, guys. So again, guys, with only three boxes, eight cards a box. You do the math, that's only 24 cards total. There will be some teams that will hit list. But, but, that doesn't mean you still can't pull fire out of these. Get a little, get a little stuck. I don't want this to get damaged or anything like that. It's like, this is a thick stack right here. Put it to the back. Okay, the house a little got the nice. Nice. I'll be driving later tonight, early morning. Like two probably when I get off air, like around two in the morning. Drive a couple hours to, to AZ. Spend Thanksgiving with my in-laws as well. So work early today at ten, probably get off like a one or two today in the morning, shower, and hit the road. Yeah, I mean, that's really what it is, Arturo, to be honest. I mean, I, I I don't blame everything on Carson Wentz, although he is playing really bad. Like I said, 40, sta 40 sacks at the end of the day, is you're not going to win good ball games. I mean, I think Joe was talking about it, and he actually admitted, like, even with his, like, team, Derek Carr, right? He has a clean pocket. Dude looks like, dude looks like Drew Brees out there, shredding defenses, you know what I mean? So, it's like... 40 of those sacks aren't all on Wentz. And, yes, I think he does need some coaching around him. Needs to hire a quarterback coach again. Needs to shake things up. Maybe give up some play calling. Well, Joe, I like to think of it as a few hours. Because once I get to the state line, it's like already halfway there. 
but I think he's just feeling so much pressure right now. Patty Mahomes, 38 out of 50. Base. Yeah, honestly, I was telling my in-laws that I wish I wish their factory or I wish they're not their factory, their their uh, their warehouse was like in Buckeye, where like Arthur is. Because, dude, if if it was in Buckeye, I'd save like an hour and a half driving all the way down to Santan from like right there. It'd only be like a four-hour drive, four and a half. And Patty uh, Patty Mahomes to Tyreek Hill, touchdown. We got Jake from nine out of seventy five, four color patch and autograph. I probably won't be tonight though, Arturo, because um got here early at ten. Probably gonna head off at one or two in the morning later, so <laughs> a long shift for me today, so my wife came in early to to work today so that way she can get off like around six or seven. Uh, we already packed, prepare the turkey, it's marinating right now. So in the morning, when I get home, early in the morning, I'm just going to shower it, and she's probably going to drive for most of the way. Detroit Lions, Jeff Okuda. But I'll drive back to him Saturday night or Sunday morning whenever we come back. But I just can't wait till like, I feel safe enough again to go to, like, Vegas and all these places. Because driving to Arizona, like, it's like almost a seven-hour drive, really, to be honest, because we stop, go to the restroom, maybe eat something halfway there. It was like 30, 40 minutes. It's like a six hour drive, so. But I just can't wait because when I go to Vegas and stuff like that. Ooh, nice Joey Bosa. 23 out of 99. It's, it's legit going to be a three and a half hour drive from us. And it's going to feel like nothing. Chargers. Going to Robert Wolf. Nice one. More Chiefs. Chiefs. Travis Kelsey. 51 out of 75. And the last one here, guys, is Jonathan Taylor. Thick patch. Five out of 15. A piece of that helmet and looks like jersey. This one's thicker than 180. Jesus. I don't even know if this is going to fit in here. Yeah, you know what? I don't think this is going to fit in the top order. Don't want to damage it, so I have to put this in a little slider box for you. There you go. Very nice. And let's um, show you guys the metal card now. Could be a gold one on one, or it's going to be a Troy ounce of fine, fine silver. Ooh, two off the jersey number, but it is a Hall of Fame Troy Ounce Silver of Steve Young. Very nice. 49ers, that is going to Alfonso. Very, very nice. We'll put that in a slider box as well. So appreciate it, guys. That was the break. Again, with three boxes. Um, you know, it's really going to be really tough to hit. But when you do hit, guys, these are very, very beautiful cards, guys. Very, very beautiful cards. So, again, guys, the next Pick Your Team is on the website. We're already in single digits as well. I'd love to run it back. This stuff is going to be fire, guys. And, um, again, Panini 101 is close as a new release. Topps Chrome Black Baseball is a new release. 
And we have other breaks that are non new releases that are close to selling out. So visit our website, guys, jazbeescasebreaks.com. And have a great, great rest of your day.